China's ambassador to Barbados, Zhu Hong, says plans are in the works to further strengthen educational links with the island. The ambassador made the comments at a function to mark the 64th anniversary of the founding of the People's Republic of China. He says this is in addition to bilateral economic agreements already signed and which will benefit both countries. Not long ago, Foreign Minister Maxim McLean and I had signed a new economic and technical cooperation agreement and currently both sides are in intensively exchanging views on some new economic and technical cooperation projects. Some of the projects for which the conditions are ripe and are set to benefit Barbados people and the economy will formally commence in the near future. After China has sent a teacher to teach Madrid in the University of West Indies at Cape Hill campus. And Prime Minister Frendel Stewart has acknowledged the close ties between the two countries. The ambassador is quite right when he says that over the last 36 years, Barbados and China have enjoyed a rich and ever-growing relationship. People-to-people -people exchanges between Barbados and the People's Republic of China have been growing. And I'm sure that I'm correct in saying that every Prime Minister of Barbados, with the exception of the late, right, excellent Errol Walton Barrow, has paid a state visit to the People's Republic of China. A Chinese-developed documentary on Barbados is expected to bring significant benefits for both countries. That's the view from China's ambassador to the island, Hu Xiong. The ambassador told CBC News that the documentary Glamorous Barbados will give Chinese people a comprehensive view of Barbados culture, traditions, and ways of life. On Barbados' part, he said the benefits will go beyond luring Chinese to the island. Many of their products uh, exported to China, uh, the exportation has now increased uh, a lot. Uh, not long ago, I visited a, a factory uh, uh, which named uh, Lenstech. Most of its products now are exported to China. Uh, I also want more Ch uh, Barbados products can be exported to China. Uh, for example, your run, uh, you have the best quality of run in the world. So I, I believe we can expand our cooperation in all this field. The ambassador was speaking to CBC during a cocktail reception held for the four-member team from the state-owned CCTV here to shoot the documentary. It's being facilitated by the CBC, the Barbados Tourism Authority, and several other government entities. A return trip fully funded by CCTV will be undertaken by a group from the CBC next month and has been described by Chairman Michael Worrell as a fantastic opportunity. I really think that the Chinese can teach us an awful lot um, about breaking down many of the old structures to doing business and equipping ourselves to, to survive in a more long-term way in this new economic environment that we see on a global scale. So we're hoping that our team can capture some interesting things, not merely looking at the culture and the geography and the food and so on, but looking at business patterns and, and trying to teach our people.